Chris Sewell here, baseball card collector, investor, dealer in that order. Welcome everyone. Hi, Rollers Time, and this week we're going to check out eBay, and haven't looked at eBay in quite a while actually. I uh, was originally going to do a regular top 10, but the top 10 was very repetitive, and a lot of cards we see all the time. So instead we're going to run, sort of do an extended honorable mentions, and run through 32 uh, five-figure eBay sales, sports card sales, over the past month or so that I sort of handpicked and found a little more interesting. And we'll run through them rapid fire style. Start off with Modern Baseball here, 2023 Tops Tier 1 Dual Booklet Auto of Shohei Otani and Mike Trout. Uh, nice looking card, BGS Mint 9. It's a one of one. It sold for $10,000 in auction. That was actually the opening bid. This sale occurred before uh, the Shohei Otani gambling allegations. Check out these next two sales. 1987 Fleer Sticker Mark Aguirre PSA Gem Mint 10 goes for $10,101. Now, the Fleer stickers are very condition sensitive because they often come with wax stains, but I didn't realize the 87 Fleer stickers here could command this sort of price. I knew the 86 could. Uh, it's a much more popular set, the very first Fleer set, but the 87s do as well. And I mean, Mark Aguirre here is a common. You could basically get this card raw, ungraded for, you know, a buck or two. Uh, but here it goes for five figures, and that's not an outlier. The Alex English did the same sort of thing. PSA Gem Mint 10 going for $10,301, both of these in auction. The Mark Aguirre is a pop seven, and the Alex English here is a pop five. You can thank the PSA set registry and pop report for these five-figure sales. How about a big MMA sale? 2009 tops UFC Ultimate Gear Rookie Relic Auto John Jones. Uh, it's graded BGS Near Mint Mint plus 8.5. The card is serial numbered out of just 25, which apparently is a pop one. $10,202. Lots of big money Victor Wembanyama sales, especially the parallels of this card here. 2023 Prism. This one's the Red Power Prism, serial numbered out of 75. PSA Gem Min 10 goes for $10,358. Pull out your change purse and throw an extra 88 cents on top of that. A bunch of interesting dual cut autos uh, this month on eBay, including this one here. Look at this thing. 2005 UDSP Legendary Cuts Dual Cut Auto of Jackie Robinson and Satchel Page. Robinson, of course, the first player to cross the color barrier. I think Satchel Page was like fifth or, or somewhere in there. Uh, absolute amazing piece of history here. Serial numbered out of just four. It's ungraded, but appears mint $10,600. See a lot of Wayne Gretzky rookies on the high rollers, although not, not ones that are autographed is this one here. 1979 OPG Wayne Gretzky rookie. Uh, the card's been autographed. It's graded a PSA X Mint 6 for the card with a DNA 10 for the auto. Although, uh, yeah, it looks like Gretzky maybe signed this while he was in a... A moving car or something like that. $10,655. 1977 Tops Reggie Jackson graded a PSA Gem Mint 10. This is, I believe, his first card with the New York Yankees. And uh, look at that sale. $10,758. Another card that you could buy for just a few dollars, sort of in raw mid-grade condition. But in a PSA Gem Mint 10 here, it is just a pop 16. Wilt Chamberlain Auto on a 1999 Upper Deck Retro. Uh, it's Ink Credible. Get that? Ink instead of Incredible. <laughs> Very clever. $10,877 for the BGS Gem Mint 9.5 with a 10 for the auto. I believe this is Will Chamberlain's first uh, autograph card in the hobby. Don't quote me on that, but that eh, probably is. 2022 Bowman Sapphire Paddle Refractor. James Wood first Bowman Chrome card. Graded PSA Mint 9. This is the one of one. $11,100 for the baseball prospect. 2020 National Treasures Rookie Patch Auto Stars and Stripes Parallel. Uh, Jordan Love Rookie, graded a PSA Mint 9 DNA 10 for the auto card, still numbered out of just 20. You get the two-color patch here, and it goes for $11,111. Check your couch cushions. You're going to need an extra penny to cover the cost on this one. 1998 Upper Deck Game Jersey, Michael Jordan, one of his first jersey cards in the hobby, especially uh, might be his first with the Bulls. Uh, again, don't quote me on that. BGS Mint 9. With, uh, with a 9.5 subgrade, $11,200. Another Michael Jordan, 1996 Skybox EX2000 credentials. Really nice looking card. Serial number out of $299. Grade of BGS Mint 9. Also a very condition sensitive card, so that's a, a tough grade. $11,211. Another example, the power of the pop report and set registry. 1971 tops, Jack Heideman. Grade of PSA Gem Mint 10. I mean, this is a pure common. It's not a high number or anything. Just a regular old common from the 1971 top set. Card you could find, you know, you would buy for maybe a quarter in raw mid grade condition, but in a PSA Gem Mint 10 goes for $11,211 as a pop two. Uh, Kaboom 2023 Panini Absolute Kaboom CJ Stroud. This is the gold parallel serial number out of just 10, uh, and it's a PSA Gem Mint 10 goes for $13,000 on the nose in auction. A little bit of hockey 2005 SP Authentic Limited. 
uh, Sidney Crosby rookie patch auto. Serial numbered out of 100. Nice three color patch. PSA gem mint 10. $13,097. I promised you multiple cool dual cut autos and your boy here has delivered 2010 Topps Triple Threads Cut Above Signature Dual Relic Auto of Warren Harding and Babe Ruth. Warren Harding being the former U.S. president, Babe Ruth being a baseball player. Not 100% sure why they put these two guys on the same card. Uh, Babe Ruth did play during the Harding administration and I think Harding was a baseball fan, but I couldn't find much else to sort of tie them together. Uh, Babe Ruth had the famous quote about a president, but it was about... Herbert Hoover, when asked uh, why he, if he was okay that he made more money than the president, he said, well, I had a better year than he did. But that was, uh, yeah, Herbert Hoover, not Warren Harding. Anyway, $13,200 for this uh, very cool one of one. Back to cards of players who are still alive. 2023 Prism Gold Prism Bryce Young Rookie. Serial number out of just 10. It's a PSA Gem Mint 10, which is a Pop 1. $13,800. And shout out to my uh, friends over at Hoodies who made the sale on this card here. Soccer 2022 Tops Museum Collection UEFA Champions League Legend Ink Framed Auto Emerald. The Emerald parallels are one of ones. And this is Steven Gerrard, graded PSA EX5. Uh, low grade for a modern card, but it's a 101, so that doesn't matter as much. $14,000 on the nose. I'm not exactly sure what this is. 2021 Curry Xbec 3-point record auto neon UV uh, card. It's not a uh, signed with a pink autograph, and it's a PSA Gem Mint 10 with a DNA uh, 10 for the auto, serial numbered out of 8. $14,000. Again, I'm not familiar with this card at all. I'm getting too old for this. 1971 Tops Larry Brown rookie. He's a Hall of Famer, and uh, this is a PSA Gem Mint 10, which is just a pop one. This is the only PSA 10 copy on planet Earth. $14,022. Doesn't it seem like the Hall of Fame rookie Pop 1 from the same year as that common we just saw, which was a Pop 2. It doesn't say, but the Hall of Famer should be a lot more than just, you know, 20% higher than the common. I don't know, just a, a thought here I had in the moment. More hockey. 2015 SP Authentic Retro Jersey Connor McDavid Rookie Patch Auto. Graded BGS Near Mint Mint plus 8.5. 10 for the auto. Serial numbered out of 25. Really nice uh, three-color patch, we'll call it, although... A lot, of, a lot of stripes going on on that patch. $14,321. If you reverse the order of the numbers and the price there, it goes 1, 2, 3, 4, or 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, somewhere in there. Uh, fun with numbers. 2004 Bowman Chrome Blue Refractor Tom Brady. This would be a fifth-year card, and this is the one of one. It's graded PSA Authentic. Not sure if there's an, an issue with the card, or the uh, submitter just chose to have it graded that way. Just short of $15,000 in auction. I promised you multiple cool dual cut autos and your boy here continues to deliver uh, 2005 UDSP Legendary Cuts dual cut auto of Branch Rickey and Jackie Robinson. The card's serial number out of just two. It's graded BGS Near Mint Mint plus 8.5. Branch Rickey was the Dodgers owner who at the time made the decision to sign Jackie Robinson, the very first player to cross the color barrier. Very cool piece of history here. $15,200. 1948 Leaf Babe Ruth from our Blazer division. Look at that beauty. Uh, Great a PSA near mint seven. Off centered top to bottom, although not too bad. Maybe the tiniest bit off centered left to right, but everything else looks almost flawless. Surface is uh, incredibly clean. $15,587.04. 2018 Tops Chrome Update Super Fractor Juan Soto Rookie Super Fractors. Uh, this Super Fractor is a one of one as they tend to be. Great a PSA Gem Mint 10, $16,000. $100. My boy Cal Ripken, 1980 Charlotte O's Police Orange Border. This is, of course, my Holy Grail card. And uh, thank you to uh, many of you who reached out and emailed me this listing. I did follow it along, but didn't really uh, consider putting in a bid. $16,400 for the PSA 3.5. Only 40 copies or so of this card has ever been graded and as known to exist on planet Earth. 1949 Bowman Satchel Page Rookie. Grid an SGC near mint mint eight. What a razor blazer of a card there. Much older SGC label when they still use the one to a hundred scale. Uh, they gave it an 88, which equates to a near mint mint eight. And yeah, really nothing to complain about. Maybe the tiniest bit off centered in both directions if you're really nitpicking. Sixteen thousand nine hundred and eighty-eight dollars and eighty-nine cents. A 1955 Topps baseball complete set. Two hundred and six cards in the set. Every card is graded. By PSA, the uh, Roberto Clemente rookie, which is the most uh, most valuable card in the set, is great at PSA for twenty thousand dollars on the nose. Vintage hockey, nineteen fifty one Parkhurst, Gordy Howe rookie, great at PSA X Mint six, and looks like a really nice six at least from here. Twenty one thousand three hundred and twenty two dollars. Back to modern, two thousand nineteen Bowman Chrome Prospects Autograph Red Shimmer Refractor, 
Julio Rodriguez, first Bowman Chrome card, graded PSA, Gem Min 10. This card is serial numbered out of just five, and it goes for 22000 400 bucks and i'll finish on this babe ruth card here 2005 donner signature stamps cut auto jersey one of one a lot of things going on here graded a bgs authentic twenty two thousand five hundred and five dollars it looks like there's a stamp there that has been signed by babe ruth and has been cut to put on the card and then it also has a relic down at the bottom like i said a lot a lot going on here 22 grand plus but that's it for this week's High Rollers. Hope everyone enjoyed uh, putting out a Adventures in Card Dealing story this Saturday. Haven't done one of those in quite a while, so hope you all join me for that. But until then, uh, have a great day. Thanks, everyone.